I'm telling you that. This is a time, this message, it may or it may not resonate. <laughs> parts may resonate, parts may not. Take what's for you and leave the rest. We have quiet stillness. Some of you have been walking um, on pathways near ponds, near water. Some of you are picking up stones, okay? I picked this up in a past reading. You may need to put those stones back, okay? Because a lot of times when people get rid of crystals, when the energy becomes too heavy, they'll dismiss of it, okay? If you're somebody that's empathic, you'll pick up on that negative energy. Leave these stones where they lay, okay? It's the message that I'm getting from you, um, for you. When I woke up this morning, I heard tenacity. You are somebody that hits the ground running. Your past these past events, feelings, and people have propelled you into a new timeline, okay? Let's see what's happening here. I think that's something with that. So wake up. It's a alarm to wake someone up, okay? We have the rebirth, right? This is a moth, it looks like, okay? Um, but, you know, it's significant of a butterfly as well. I'm hearing like a moth to a flame burned by the fire. Some of you may have been in the dream state healing, okay? Some of you may have woken up crying is what I'm getting. You have past life energy. That this could be someone in the past, okay? Meaning someone that you've already healed from trying to connect with you. Or someone that you may not know. Trying to send you telepathic memories. Somebody feels lonely, they feel drained, all right? I'm hearing persevere. You could be this person in this energy where you you have to rebirth, you have to reparent yourself. And it's nothing wrong with that. And it's never too late is what I'm getting. Ethan, show me what it is I need to see. Look at that. The lotus flower. All right. So you are definitely having a rebirth. Some of you are thirsty for knowledge, which is a beautiful thing. And justice. Yeah, peace, a peace of mind, okay? Peace and tranquility. Some of you are connecting with your ancestors in the dream state. They're holding on to you, all right? If you wake up crying, it's because you've getting, you're have getting you getting some sort of sense of peace yeah, when you enter the dream over. realm. Mother Nature's balance and hidden learning. So there's something that some of you may be refusing right to now? see. Look at all this, deep listening. You may be, you may be going in nature... All right. And you may feel like the trees and the elements are talking to you. OK, some of you may not see that uh, a situation that you are in is bearing no fruit. If this is you, if this is not you, this is somebody that you're thinking of. Woman's wisdom. Isn't that wonderful? OK, so some of you are connected with some deep, deep, deep ancestral knowledge and we have healing sure journey so, so know that somebody's holding your hand through this time here you're following your own judged. intuition okay not following the ways of the world Abudula. which Abudula. for me that signifies What's cracking? that you are entering that place Amara John. yeah where things are changing Okay, so you may have uh, emotionally exhausted yourself trying to get Everywhere individuals world. to see things your way. I've That's been here, all right? So as these ch seasons change, it's giving me allergies too, okay? Silence. People are watching you, okay? Especially if you have a platform, if you have a website, if you're on social media, which a lot of us are. 
people are watching you in silence wanting to come together okay you're picking up the energy of people that are just like you can if you're in la here soon all right or anywhere in some California. Some of you could be in the LGBTQIA or community. Or Colorado and California. Or some of you are really leaning on your friends at this time. Some you of you, you do have some um, sister Chop support. You may be in a Hit sorority or something like that. Okay? But there's definitely a rebirth happening for you. I think this healing journey, uh, for those of you that are with someone, uh, you, you, you definitely are in a connection that is very healing helping you release trauma others of you you are learning how to balance your masculine and your feminine energies okay this may have been something that you did in the past um okay some of you may have accepted um being the side piece whether if you're male or female all right some of you may have felt like that's all you could get <clears throat> you may have been raised to believe that as long as you have a man, uh, you know, you're doing better than others. So you may have self-sacrificed a I lot. So now you're in the energy, yeah, you're in the energy of learning who you stopped. are, stepping off on your own. This could be you or someone that you're dealing with. You went through a part of a period of healing, with. deep healing, okay? This is ancestral healing. Some of you, you've lost so much that you have no choice but to pay attention to your ancestors, honor your ancestors every day, because those are the people that are going to, are the energies that are going to yeah, um, out here. send you those synchronicities, okay? Of course, well, these are you, energies ancestors. that work for the divine. Some of you, these are trapped souls, okay? God. Trap souls. Angels. Yeah. The whole gang's out here. So you're learning how to... Connect with your solar plexus, learning how to trust your gut with woman's wisdom. The silence energy is giving me, you're not really saying like too, too much to people. Oh, I trust okay? like you that. may be getting a lot of DMs. People may be talking behind your back or they were in the yeah, past. But I feel like now they're just passed. watching in awe. Okay? So there's definitely, somebody could have passed over. This person may have wished you death. What are you going to pass okay. over here this, I, this rival woman or rival man that you're you're dealing with. This is an individual that didn't know you were as wise as you are. I do hear hospice. Somebody could be that. a healthcare worker. You may um, be around a lot of older individuals. No. Okay. Why is healing journey here? Some of you could be having a relative that may be in hospice or 